everyone and welcome back to my channel so different setting and stuff and that is because I'm actually in Florida until July 2nd so I'm going to be filming in this area if I film any more like sit down videos like this this is the background you'll have because of that I kind of want to apologize um for like the bad lighting and like the bad quality because I am filming on my MacBook but the reason why I have to film on my MacBook is because um I actually ended up breaking up with my ex-boyfriend and I had to give him his camera back and stuff that's I what I was using to film so I have to stick with this until I find a new camera but I didn't want to keep going without videos since you guys went so long without videos from me before so I apologize about the quality and this lighting may not be the best but this is the best I could find since it's like 10 o'clock at night and also sorry if I'm talking kind of low because my family is already sleeping. I got a comment on one of my videos requesting a what's in my purse and I'm going to be doing that today because I thought it was like a nice quick video that I could make sure I got done. With that being said, let's move on right into the video. This is my purse. It's actually very, very new. I got it less than a month ago. It's from Michael Kors. It's this blue color. It has um, pockets on the sides. It says Michael Kors up here. It has a little Michael Kors MK um keychain it's very cute i think it's very chic and simple yet also keeping it really cute um i have my winter michael kors purse this is my summer and spring the other one is my winter and fall i really liked the style of that one with the pockets on the sides but i wanted one that zipped across the top and didn't have like a middle divider in the purse so this was perfect it fit everything i was looking and this was originally $248 and I got it on sale for $173. I don't know the exact purse that it is, but I will leave a link to it in the description box in case you guys are interested in purchasing it. Some of the stuff isn't always in here and then there are some stuff that is missing. So, yeah. So the first thing I have in here are my sunglasses. I've had these for about three years. They're actually broken. The lens falls out every now and then. But... They're my favorite. I wore them all day today. I love these sunglasses and they're from Coach. Second thing is this Smart Water. I bought this to drink on the plane because they only give you those small little cups. So I just bought this for the plane. The next thing I have there is the last lecture which I actually have to read over the summer for school they gave it to us on orientation so I had this in here in case I'm on the beach the pool I found any free time on the plane just to basically get it done nice and early in the summer so I don't procrastinate I have my boarding pass I have a headband I have trident layers and if you're not a trident layer fan then you're not living your life correctly if you haven't tried trident layers you need to go buy some right now because you're doing something wrong and the best flavor is strawberry and tangy citrus so the next thing I have in here is my wallet I did get the matching wallet to go with the bag because I'm like weird like that I like my stuff to match I have all these card slots on either side and then you have a zipper in the middle so in the middle zipper I just have change and stuff like that then in the little open area on the side here I actually have a Mesquamagate parking receipt, my Mystic Aquarium ticket, $5 off Bertucci's, and a Sweet Frog gift certificate. And then on the other open side, I have a lotto that I actually am waiting to see if my number came in. I can either win 300 or 40 so going for the 300 just have blended tickets because me and my two cousins went to go see it not too long ago um you have two slots behind the cards for money so i just have my money on this side and then i'll go through some of my cards on this side i have my license and my um school id then here i have my sally's card and my triple a card down here in this slot i have my debit card and then over here, I have my Beauty Insider card and my Ulta card. On the other side, I just have my Six Flags Season Pass. Below that, I have a $10 TGI Fridays gift card. Over here, I actually still have my Cousin Season Pass because I forgot to give it back to her. And then below that, I just have an um, accessory 
gift card with like 50 cents left on it. And the next thing I have is my chargeable phone case, which comes in absolute handy. My phone dies all the time and I get really grouchy when my phone dies because I basically live off of it. So this is a lifesaver. It's $80, which can be very expensive for something like this, but it's worth it. You will probably use this as much as your toothbrush. Even probably, you actually will. It's a guarantee. I have is my other portable charger because as you can see, my phone does not die. I cannot stand it. It is such a pet peeve when my phone dies. So I actually have another portable charger and this one was like $12 off of Amazon so I will leave a link to this in the description box as well as this one in case you're interested in either but this is definitely a more affordable option if you don't want to drop 80 bucks on a charging phone case I actually have this little flashlight charging thing so you can take this and plug this in the USB part instead of the your cord and then when you turn it on and it's a little flashlight so it could come in handy if you're out at night if you're looking for something in your purse at night it's actually like really handy and I've found myself using it a few times already and I also have my phone charger and headphones in here but those are both over by my bed because I'm going to be using them but I also have these two cords which I plug into my phone charger to charge the portable chargers when those are dead so got to keep those with you because it's kind of pointless if you go to use your portable charger and the portable charger is dead. So that is everything in the main pocket. Now moving on to the two sides. One little side pocket. I have these um, Sonia Kashuk blotting sheets which come in great handy especially in the summertime when you sweat and your face gets really oily and you start to shine a lot. These are amazing because they remove the oil but they don't take off your face makeup. In my other section I have my ancient iPod. Don't even know why this is in here to be honest. It doesn't even turn on. I think it did at one point but this is like the very first iPod Touch to ever be released. Like when I say dino this is like a legit fossil. I have this lysine cold sore remover or this cold sore treatment because Sometimes they get them in the winter time and they hurt so bad. And then I also have these blink contacts eye drops because when my eyes get dry my contacts start to bother me. It can kind of look like I'm high and I don't smoke so I just put some of these in my eyes so that my eyes stay moist and I don't get like bloodshot eyes. The pocket next to that has this little portable brush in mirror which I absolutely love having this because I hate tangles I brush my hair all the time and it's very convenient I also found a little clip and in this zipper side compartment here I usually have um, Tylenol and Pepto-Bismol but I took it out because I just didn't want to take any risks by trying to get that stuff on the plane I think you can carry it and you're carrying on but I wasn't sure and then I just have other sort of lady products then all I keep in these side pockets is usually my phone because I don't want to carry it around. So my case is from Victoria's Secret if you're also interested. And I also usually have my keys in here but since I'm on vacation I didn't really need to bring my keys so I don't have them. Thank you so much for requesting this video. Thank you so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed it and look forward to, for some more Florida videos. I think I'm going to be doing a follow me around vlog next which a lot of you have also been messaging me asking for. So. Thanks for watching. I hope you enjoyed and I'll see you in my next video. Bye!